J. Calvin Johnson. Um, I'm the CEO of C Funk Art, and um, here at October Gallery, figured I'd come by to uh, help out a little bit. You know, show some support, and just brought some artwork that I just finished the last couple days. And I'm into putting, say for instance, this one here is Muhammad Ali, and this is a picture from him standing over. Sonny Liston, painting that I wanted to do a, for a long time. I just like the facial features and just the expression on his face. And so I'm working on this this new style that I've picked up maybe in the last couple of years. I call it sort of like a bubble bubble art. And really all it is is just um, textures and uh, a lot of layered paint. And then it looks almost like bubbles or jelly beans once you put the varnish on. And I'm into now use, utilizing wood. And uh, so I'm really enjoying this. I'm, I'm, now that I'm back in Philly, kind of like back in, getting back in touch with my roots. And so I really like working uh, in, in acrylic, but I also like to make pieces that inspire and educate and things like that. So I'm really into trying to inspire our youth with their uh, education. This piece here is called Knowledge Speaks Volumes. And so you have your, your kids going to school and going into a building that is volumes of 12 volumes of books. Uh, and then the clouds are basically uh, figures of uh, graduates. And these two pieces here are, it's uh, an extension of a painting I did a few years ago called The Learning Tree. And so this is basically about education and inspiring them to stay in school and the sky's the limit. This piece here actually the first piece of my experimental canvas on wood uh, series and so when I first got this wood and, and, and treated it it looked like the side of a shack and I just felt because it was Martin Luther King's birthday that that was the image that I was going to put on here and so it just, I just felt like that would be somewhere where a colored only sign would be and what better suitable person to have in front of that than, my, than Martin Luther King Jr. So I'm just happy to be back in Philadelphia and, and involved again with the October Gallery.